Jason Eichelberger, Prep Cal Track, here with our boys' individual Division One and Two sweepstakes winner, Omar Reyes, El Camino High School. Congratulations, Omar! Uh, if you could just sort of take me through this race. Uh, cross country is a sport where it's not only the physical, but it's the the mental. Um, take me through your strategy here today. You did a great job sticking with the leader early on. And uh, when did you see your point where you could attack? Um, so this race, uh, it was a strategic race. Uh, I knew I had a lot of good competitors with me, so I wanted to play strategically. I didn't just want to go all out, go on the lead. I knew how to slowly build my way up for a win. So on that first part, I still got that guy from Poly. I think his, I believe his name was Cam. I still got him a good part of it. Those first two loops of five, I knew that was a good mark. Um, they also hit sub 15. And from there, I knew Jason was going to lead this race. He's the top one for athletic.net. I knew, I knew he was going to be that top guy leading. So I wanted to stick with him. Uh, I stood behind him uh, most of the time. He had a good, he had a good um, medium-sized gap on us, and I knew I wanted to slowly inch. This is Mount Sac. The hills are what you use to catch up to people, so I wanted to use that strategically. So up each hill, um, like me and some two other guys behind me, we slowly started closing the gap with him. And up that second hill, I think it was a poop out hill, I believe. Um, that hill, I wanted to go up and start separating from the guys behind me. I didn't, I didn't want them beside me anymore. I wanted to just go closer up to him because he's my main goal. He's what I he's what I try to be. And slowly creep up on him um, on that reservoir hill. That's where it's time to attack. Uh, I knew up that final hill, it was all or nothing. If I wasn't going to be able to pass him here, he's going to just kick down the hill and I wouldn't have any other chance to catch up to him. So I knew up the hill, I had to go all out, just, just feel the pain, just accept it. And that's what I did. I slowly passed him up the halfway on the reservoir hill. And then halfway up there, um, I just passed him and I used that downhill as a way to just extend the gap and just solidify right there my position and just start kicking. And that's what I did all the way down the hill. And then all the way to the end, I just started kicking. And I knew from there, I think I had a good solid lead. And I was like, I got the win, yeah. And I'm super grateful for it. I'm super stoked. Uh, Mount Sac is a phenomenal race, phenomenal runners. I'm super grateful to be here and, uh, to get To be able to execute like that, what does that tell you about where you are, you know, at this point in the season and how you can build the momentum as we get now into the back half of the season and then on into CIF competition? Um, what what this shows to me right now is a great checkpoint. Um, this race, uh, it's hilly and everything. The state course is also really hilly, so that gives me a good position. Now. I got the hills marked down. I just got to work more on just sticking with the group that I want, um, pushing. Uh, a lot of a lot of it is mentally. Uh, I just got to work on my mindset. Um, a lot of it is just pain. I just gotta just gotta learn how to like fight it. And um, this race is a great example of finding that pain mindset because it is painful. It hurts. Um, and um, this just this shows me a great future on what I have for hilly courses, um, for flat courses. If I can get a, 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 a hilly course of the 14, I can definitely get a really low low one for, for a flat course. So it really shows me great great indicator on that. Well, obviously indications are that you're heading in the right direction. Again, congratulations, Division One Two Individual Sweet Stakes here at Mount Sac. Omar Reyes, our winner here, El Camino 1449. Thank you.